guys i am yogesh and welcome to my channel in this video i will discuss what is communication its process and its type those who are going to appear for net exam knows that know that that there is in general paper there is topic communication you need for so it is very important video for those who are going to appear in net and set exam so let us start a communication is a common phenomenon as we all are social element and we cannot live without communication indeed the very attempt of not communicate is also a communication communication refer to two way process of conveying information ideas feelings of conveying ideas feelings or opinion between two or more person either verbally or non verbally using a medium generally we can say that communication means sharing of ideas feelings messages the process of communication start with sender who has something to share or communicate with other then sender encodes the message in which receiver can correctly understand medium of expression can be different as speaking writing eye contact gesture sign etc etc then after and the message is developed by the communicator communicator using the right set of language and medium message is the most element most important element of communication then comes channel which implies the carrier of the message which can be telephonic email letter face to face etc etc receiver is the person to whom the communicator direct the message he is one who get the message it is very important for the sender to understand receiver's ability and interpretation capacity for effective communication the next step is decoding of the message by the receiver if after decoding the message the receiver re revert back to sender in the form of feedback feedback is very important as it suggests that receiver got the message and understand it for the feedback the receiver use the channel the same channel which sender has used and effective communication is always receiver oriented rather than message oriented so i hope that you are understand the communication process now we comes to the types of communication types of communication are based on channel and based on purpose based on per channels have three other types it includes verbal communication non verbal communication visual communication communication verbal communication can be in oral or written form in oral form it can be face to face voice chat video chat conference etc in written form there can be letters sms email now non verbal form as body language eye contact etc in visual form you may have drawing graphics etc based on purpose there are two types of communication one is formal and another is informal formal communication has three types vertical horizontal and diagonal and informal informal communication is a ca casual communication with that does which does not does not follow any rules and regulations of communication in next lecture we will understand and we will see the seven c's of communication and barrier of communication i hope to have understand communication process do like 